Oh, hello. Welcome into my workshop and welcome to the show Creations of Clay. My name is Louis Palladini and today I like to paint the hippo head that we made a few weeks ago. I'm going to show you how to paint that from start to finish. So it's been fired in the oven. I, I put a nice little primer on it and we're all ready to go. The types of colors I'll be using today, I'm using acrylic paints. I'm using a couple of dark browns right here. There's a couple of more like light brown colors here. I'm using for the mouth, I'm using uh, a pink. I'm going to mix it with a, a red oxide or a rust type color. I'm going to use black for the eyes and I'm going to use uh, um, bleached titanium, like an off-white for the teeth. So the first thing that we want to do is I want to paint the, um, okay, let's see. I want to paint the, uh, the base coat on the, the uh, hook bell. So put those right there. And I'm going to put that right there. Okay. So now we're just going to dab that quickly. Put that. So what I want to do is put a nice, nice coat on this right now. Just dab that very quickly. See how that's filling in nicely. And look at that. Come on, really nice. See that? That's looking real good. Put the front there. I just want to make sure we get the rest of the side there. Ah, looks real good. Uh, I'm just going to dry my hands a little bit. I'm going to have to use the blow dryer on that. That yeah, seems to be dry enough. So the next thing we'll do is we'll take a that up there it's already been used we're gonna use another brown color put that right there we'll clean this out a little bit from the first and we're ready to go for the second color So I'm just going to flick this around a little bit. Flick that around. that look nice. Yeah, it looks good. And then, so you got to go all around, just flick the, the paint. I'm going to dab it. And 
we'll do that. So that gives us a really nice base coat to start. So. We'll do that. Just want to make sure I don't forget any spots. Go all around. Just kind of check for any areas I might have missed. See that? Coming along nicely. Oh, okay, so the next thing that we want to do is I'm just going to blow dry that a little bit so it's not so sticky to work with. The next thing we want to do is I want to do the inside of the mouth here where I'm pointing to and I'm going to take and we're going to mix a couple of different colors. I'm going to use a light pink and then I'm going to add like a rust type color to it. Put that there. And then we'll mix it together a little bit. Let's see, I wanna make sure that, see that, we're just gonna mix that. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that gives it a nice color. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to take and just kind of paint the inside of the mouth like with that, that color we just mixed. See that? I'm painting the inside right there. do that. We'll make it look real nice. There we go. So then I want to continue working on the the bottom part of the mouth now. See that? Want to make sure we didn't forget anything. Gonna make sure we paint that. Making sure we don't forget anything. Now I want to show you. See that how we painted the inside? Looks pretty good. The next thing that I want to do is we want to paint the teeth or the tusks inside the hippo's mouth. So I'm going to use the off-white color. So we just want to paint these tusks of the mouth. Now I'm going to paint these. them okay I'm 
And that's what you do for the teeth. You might want to add it after this dries. I would probably paint it one more time just to give it a, a make it look a little more white than it does right now. So, but I'll show you how to paint the other colors on the the hippo. The uh, now we're going to do the the eyes. So we get a little black here. Now we'll do the eyes. And we're also going to do the inside of the nostrils with the black. So first we'll hit the inside of the nostrils. So what I'm doing, see the inside of the nostril here? I'm going to hit that with the, with the black. Right there. And that looks good. And now we're going to paint the eye right here with the black. Make sure we paint that nice. See that? Really makes a difference once you add in the paint to the clay. So I'm going to do that one right there. See that? Came out pretty nice. And now what we're going to do is that color we mixed a few minutes ago with the rust color in the... I want to do the inside of the ears on the hippo. See this? And then we'll paint the other side. See how we did that? It's looking nice. And now the next thing that we want to do is I want to paint, let me see right here. We're going to paint the hippo head, add a little more color to his, uh, we're going to do a lighter brown. Okay, so now I'm going to use that lighter brown color. We'll do that. I just want to use my other one as a model. Okay, it's going to just kind of dab it here and there. We'll lighten them up a little bit. I do see if some browns here that um, when I did do the mouth, I kind of painted over some stuff. So we're going to go back with the, the dark brown and kind of cover some of that. You know, that happens sometimes. I so just, uh, just want to cover that up a little more. Yeah, that looks good. See that? You always want to be able to touch up things. You know, sometimes you paint over stuff that... Uh, it needs to be touched up, so it's very easy to do. 
So next thing we want to do is we'll come back with that light brown color now. We'll kind of just Let me just flick that over the lower part of the jaw a little bit. Flick that there. Do that there. On the top of the head, just kind of flick a little bit. Add a little variation of color. And yeah, it's starting a little come along nicely. See that? We'll flick, do around the eyes a little bit. See that? Do it a little bit around the eye. I'm lightening it up a little bit. See that? I'm kind of lightening them up. Put a little variation of color by doing that. Now, it's starting to look pretty good. So, it looks like he's just about done. So, what I'll do is I'll show you what the final version of the hippo will look like. Just going to dry the hands a little bit and got a lot of paint on them, so I don't want to uh, get it on my one that's already dried. So we'll get rid of that. But this is what the final version of the hippo will look like. So see how we painted all the, the teeth here with the off-white? The teeth in the bottom. And see how we got that nice color that we mixed with the, the off the uh, actually light pink in our red oxide color, and it gives it that really nice um, color when you mix the two together. You can see how we did the the nice eyes here. See how with the Mars black, that there, how we had put the the color in the nostrils, that nice base coat where we used the the dark browns, and then you know. And then we came back in and we did a lighter brown over the whole thing. And I'll just kind of rotate that so you can see the whole thing really slowly. And that's what the top will look like. But that's what the final version of the hippo head will look like. I do want to thank you for coming to the show, Creations in Clay. And I do look forward to seeing you again next week. Goodbye for now.